It's about helping today's generation of students succeed in the real world. A pilot program at Kelly Road Secondary infuses project-based learning with hands-on technology. The Northern Learning Centre has almost finished its first semester. This is the new face of education in the digital age. Students in the Northern Learning Centre are plugged into the internet through digital devices and laptops. It's a bring your own device program, so every student has a, a laptop or a netbook and they're working on that all day, every day. It means leaving books behind and embracing technology. The students seem to be enjoying the new setting. My parents saw it and they thought it would be a good idea to learn the influence of different kinds of technologies and through physical project-based learning. So it was kind of their idea first and then once I kind of joined the program I noticed that it's actually a lot of fun. I find it, it helps me more because I'm not a very good reader and I find it's easier to use the internet because I can see it better and everything. Technology isn't the only way this program is unique. The big thing is project-based learning um, and just that in, in that their, their work is always you know, applied to a bigger project or a bigger um, you know, product that they would produce at the end of it and we try very much to make those real world projects. My favorite part of this program I'd have to say is like the science darkroom getting to like work with cameras for grade eights and help develop them and take pictures with the grade nines and starting to develop them. So we work in groups like almost every day and it really helps benefit because we all talk together and we talk about what we could benefit off of and how we can benefit off of everything. While the transition may be smooth for students, the changes have had a mixed reaction from parents. I mean, there's, there's a lot of changes in the, in the room and the way we're doing learning and the way we're doing um, our work here. And uh, so there's, there's a lot of new things for the students to figure out and for parents to kind of get familiar with. And there's a learning curve for teachers as well. Beth and I really enjoy the opportunity to, to collaborate and to kind of discuss our projects together and to check in day to day to see how projects are going or students are doing. The biggest difference is we're trying to get a, a big idea or a big question to kind of center all of our activities and the interdisciplinary aspect of it. So instead of just planning a unit for English or socials or whatever, we're trying to tie them all in together and think of a, a bigger relevance or a real world application to this idea. Beth Wilcox says she's definitely seeing results from the new learning tools. The students wrote memoirs and they revised it over and over and over and over again uh, with feedback from myself and other students and the work is amazing. So the memoirs I see are at a very, very high level, um, way beyond what I would normally see in a grade 8 or 9 classroom. If students or parents would like to connect with this innovative program, a showcase night will be held January 30th.